my training in nutrition was non-existent. Um, I gained quite a lot of weight in quite a short period of time due to a little period of ill health. Um, so I kind of just given up on everything. My fears really were people judging me because I'm a lot bigger than some of the, the other people I perceived would come to the gym. I thought that I'd be judged or people would secretly giggle or laugh at my attempts to do some of the exercises. I thought it would just be full of sculpted girls and muscle-bound guys all kind of competing to show how fit and amazing they were and I did wonder whether there was whether there was a spot for somebody slightly older and rather dumpy. I thought, oh, is this really going to be the right environment for me? But I woke up one day, saw the advertisement, and I thought, I'm, I'm, I'm going to apply. I'm just going to do it. And I did it. And I didn't tell anybody I'd done it. My partner, nobody. Because I have a history of, hey, look, I've bought all these Zumba workout CDs and never do them. I'm quite a fly-by-night kind of person. If there's a, you know, a fad going, I'm in. I've had really, really good results. I've dropped, uh, just coming up to two dress sizes. Um, <clears throat> my nutrition, I understand nutrition a lot better, a lot better. Uh, I thought before nutrition was salad for breakfast, lunch and dinner, and uh, that was that. But I really, I'm by no means fully conversant, but really got to grips with the nutrition side of things. Um, and my fitness is um, oh, it's 100 times better than when I first started. We support each other, uh, we congratulate each other and share in each other's successes. And that support, when you're coming to the end of a workout and you're doing a finisher or you've got one last thing to do and everyone's cheering you on, it's unbelievable.